While they play the intimacy card game, our eyes and ears, intimacy expert, Dr. Mpume, commentary. what she reads into this special relationship. You ready? Okay, first. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, when did you realize you were in love with me? The first day I saw you, I was like, damn, I'm in love. <laughs> I want to get married. <laughs> Okay. So what's your biggest insecurity? I used to be insecure a lot about relationships, um, especially for people dating me for the wrong reasons and sometimes overlooking the fact that I am an individual. Well, you did say, I remember. I did say that a lot in the house. (laughs) But you came and you, you showed me otherwise. And I think 71 days was enough for us to yeah, boy. <laughs> what is the one thing about my personality you don't like but have accepted because you love me? I love everything about you. Mm. My brother, I don't lie. Yo. Even the stuff I don't love and other people's stuff I don't like, I can't take from other people. Mm-hmm. I love them when you do them. So I love everything about you. If you say so now. <laughs> Has there been a time in the past when you so had? Doubt it. Or maybe they didn't trust the true love. Yes, before I came to the show. The thing is, I, I love, I, I mean, I love love, so I can never give up on loving. I didn't think that after the house, I would be in a relationship. Surely not with guy with, with the guy with red hair. The guy with red hair stole my heart. <laughs> <laughs> Complete the sentence. You like it when I... When you talk daddy. <laughs> <laughs> My brother, what are you doing now? <laughs> okay, I learned it from you now. <laughs> what kind of touch do you enjoy? Yeah, I enjoy your cuddles. You give the best spooning. spooning. <laughs> <laughs> you give the best spooning, so... Yeah, I, I miss that when I don't see you. Where is the strangest place you've ever had sex? Uh, the strangest place? Mm-hmm. In the cinema. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. All right. I, I've also had sex in the cinema. Wow. But it wasn't wow. good. It was awkward. Yeah. But it was not... It worked. You did it. Yeah. Strange. Yeah. Yeah. Strange. Okay. When was the last time I made you feel appreciated? Today. Today. Yes, babe. Every morning you wake up and tell me you appreciate me and you love me. So there isn't the last time. It's always you know, all the time. So I, I appreciate that about you. You're so humble and loving. So, man, you're Thank amazing. You the card already. Okay. <laughs> Don't make me <laughs> Okay. What's an aspect of yourself that you would like to improve? I would, I would like to have more patience. I think I'm not patient enough. Mm, I'm only not, patient with you, but like... The oh. people around us, you Yeah, can't. I think I would yeah. love, love to improve that. We can work on it. One day at a time. (laughs) What's your favorite memory from our relationship, like so far? The favorite memory is when I first heard your voice for the first time. Before we went into the Big Brother house. And you were blindfolded. I was blindfolded. Marabu Papa saying, oh, who's this girl with a nice hat and all of that. (laughs) So to me then. I could see you. But I saw your shoes. And I was like, I'm going to look for this guy with these type of shoes. And when I saw you, to find out that we are walking into the house together. So literally walking into the house together signified a lot of things for me. Um, We walked into a new life together. We walked into a healing space together because... I always say, us being in the house was a life-changing experience. So we grew together. Wow. Yeah. (laughs) Is there a sexy song that tends to get you in the mood? It changes every time because I would have this one for for like three months and then it's no longer that song. But for now, 
Babe, he literally listens. We listen to your music by force. <laughs> there isn't any other artist in playing the house. So can we improve on that? Okay. Yes, I love your music, that. but like we need to have other artists play. And besides you having things, because when I play certain artists, like, why are you listening to this guy? So wow. <laughs> can we try and improve on that so we can like improve our variety of music? But you always listen to your but music. But you don't like my playlist because you say, I do. Why? Last time I told you I like the playlist you are playing. Hmm. Probably the one there. Okay. Last question of the day. Mm-hmm. When do people judge us and why do you think they do? People judge us all the time. Ni Sangoma, and you're a Christian. And to people, that's like, what you the hell is happening sense. here? But we have managed to find a common ground for the both of us. And I love you beyond your spiritual belief. And you have accepted me. I love you, man. Um, I love you, my babe. Yeah, I love you I too. want to tell you. And you know I don't listen to nobody, right? I listen Damn to only you. <laughs> but I love you, babe. I love you too. Thank you.